The genre of the book of Deuteronomy is not much different from that of Exodus. It is narrative history and law, although there is a song from Moses just after he commissions Joshua. This song describes the history that the Israelites had experienced. Moses wrote Deuteronomy approximately 1407 to 1406 BC. The key personalities are Moses and Joshua. Moses wrote this book to remind the Israelites of what God had done and to remind them of what God expects of them. The name literally means, second law. Moses gives, the law, for the second time. In chapters 1 to 4, Moses reviews some of the details of the past history of Israel such as the Exodus and the wandering in the wilderness. He then urges that they obey the laws of God. Then, in chapters 5 to 28 Moses restates the Ten Commandments to the Israelites. Moses explains the principles and instructions for living a godly life as God's chosen nation. These include how to love the Lord, laws of worship, laws regarding relationships, like divorce, and also the consequences and penalties if these laws are broken. Chapters 29 to 30 there is a move to commit themselves, as a nation, and to stand apart unto God. This consists of not only knowing the many laws that God has commanded, but also obeying them and placing God first. Finally, in chapter 31 through 34, we see the first change in leadership in Israel. Moses, the one who has been leading them the entire time, hands over his authority to Joshua and commissions him. Moses blesses the tribes, which reminds us of Jacob blessing his sons almost 450 years earlier. In the last chapter, God shows Moses the promised land, although he cannot enter it, after this, Moses the servant of the Lord dies on Mount Nebo.